If we don't fund nuclear research and development in the United States, then the United States will lose its leadership position worldwide. We essentially invented this technology. We have been world leaders in the United States for many decades, and we have the capability and the talent and the expertise to continue that leadership. The Bristol Test Reactor, once it is up and running, will absolutely be a, a crucial part of that technology leadership for the United States. The versatility of VTR is going to enable it to be used to help with testing and demonstration of facets of new advanced reactor technology. So for example, molten salt reactors or lead cooled reactors or sodium cooled reactors and high temperature gas reactors all can benefit from a testing reactor like VTR. The timing is really important because at the moment, the United States does not have such a testing capability. And really, uh, the, the only capability that does exist is, is in Russia, in China as well. And so if we are aiming to uh, increase the testing capability of the United States, it behooves us to have a test reactor in the United States as well. The need for VTR is anticipated for many decades to come. And as we evolve our materials, as we advance in fuel development, there's always going to be a need for that testing capability. That is one of the key points for VTR is that it starts to position the U.S. again as, a, as a, one of the world leaders in nuclear technology. VTR, solving energy challenges through science.